Hey Leo, welcome to Awaken Blue Heart Tarot. My name is Danielle. We're going to go ahead and get started with your September reading. Um, this is going to be from now up until September the 16th. So yeah, I'm interested to see what's going on with you guys. Hope everyone has been doing great. Okay, so I'm going to pull three cards from the Romance Angel deck first, and then we're going to go ahead and jump into your reading. All right. Oh, wow. Immediately. <laughs> this could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you seek. Okay, Leo. You could barely even shuffle and <laughs> jumped out at me. <laughs> okay. Keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. Last card. Codependency. Addictions are affecting your romantic life. All right, Leo. So... <sighs> Let's see what's going on with you guys. All right, Leo, 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 Leo. So some of you guys, you know, have met, you know, the person that, you know, you could see yourself being with. Um, and they want you to keep an open mind about it. But somebody could be codependent to a situation or you could be codependent to a person, you know. So let's just kind of see. Again, guys, you know, just take whatever fits. You know, the, the readings aren't going to resonate with everybody, you know. So just take what fits. All right, that feels good. All right, Leo. So let's cut the deck and then we're going to get started here. All right. Bottom of the deck. You guys are undecided about something with the Nine of Wands here. All right. So let's see what's going on with Leo. King of Wands. Okay, so some of you guys could be dealing with another fire sign. Aries, another Leo like yourself, or Sagittarius. If not, um, I'm feeling like you guys are feeling like somebody's being a player. Is what I'm getting. Tell me more, please. The King of Wands in reverse. Look at that. It's another king. I told you. Two people. That's two men, two women. They're not gender specific, so just take whatever fits, guys. But definitely two people. They're here. Um, fire sign, like I said, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. King of Cups, Water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. What is going on? Somebody could be emotional right now. Look, somebody has a lot of other options or multiple options here. Could be you, Leo, or this other person. But I'm feeling like it's the other person, Leo. You might have found out that they were being a player. They have other options, too many people, and you walked away from them. Yeah, because you're realizing with the Six of Swords in reverse, things were not turning around at all. Y'all, yeah, the cards are playing peekaboo. <laughs> all right, so Knight of Cups. It's like. I feel like they want to offer you an apology, but maybe you're not feeling confident in the situation anymore. Yeah, and it's like, you don't want to give them another chance. Like, for some of you guys, I really do feel like this person's going to come in and try to apologize to you, try to make it work, but it's like, I'm done, I'm tired, I'm cutting it off with the king of, excuse me, queen of swords in reverse. Oh my God, y'all, you can't make this up. This is two, it's two women. Yeah, it's like somebody is dealing with, like I said, they're not gender specific. It's definitely people here, okay? And uh, fire signs, water signs, um, air signs, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. I haven't seen Earth yet, but there's definitely two people here. Hmm, okay. <sighs> Lord, what is going on, Leo? We supposed to start the month out like this? But you're feeling like there's no security. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't either. Everybody's playing in this party. Like, uh-uh. Ace of Pentacles. It's like, you know, you feel like there's no security in the situation. But there's still something coming in that you're hoping and wishing for. Look, I mean, all the queens gonna come and join us today. I mean, but this could be you. <laughs> this could be you, Leo. It's like, you know, you're not being positive about the situation anymore um but i do feel like somebody is interfering here because at the end of the day like you want an equal partnership you want that give and take relationship you want happiness with this person you really do but you you know that there's no balance with them could be a fire sign um excuse me sagittarius well they're a fire sign but yeah sagittarius codependency what did i talk about at the beginning page of pentacles in reverse somebody is codependent to a person a situation you know it could be anything. Finances. Tell me about the Page of Pentacles in reverse. Whatever it is, they're not telling you. It could be money. 
Yeah, somebody wants stability in the situation. Could be dealing with an Aries here. But somebody's definitely looking for stability. With death in reverse, could be a Scorpio. But the situation needs to come to an end, okay? Some of you guys have children with this person. What just fell? I'm sorry, guys. Oh, my gosh. I'm sorry. Hold on. I can't get it. Ah! <laughs> oh, my God. Okay felt on the side of my desk i apologize um but yeah some of you guys could have children with this person um uh, but it's like if not you saw yourself you know building a family or having kids with them but you're frustrated and you're not opening up y'all these cards are flying out of my head what's going on with y'all energy oh my gosh okay let me see what we got here <sighs> Yeah, somebody's having a hard time. Could be an earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. They could be struggling with finances or maybe somebody's just having a hard time because they're not happy. They're not content with this love situation here. But, Leo, I feel like every day you're getting stronger here. It's, it's yeah, day by day because you're, you're hurt. But you're getting over it. But it's like you're realizing this person is just sneaky, you know? They're sneaky, but you're coming out of feeling like something's been lost here. And at the end of the day, you want something to improve with the situation, but things are just moving really slow. They're not going at the speed that you want, okay? And you're disappointed about it. You're disappointed about that third-party situation. Some of you guys could have been dealing with the Libra with justice here, or maybe you're still trying to find out the truth. Maybe you weren't given, you know, clarity with the third-party situation. Some of you guys could be going through a legal situation as well. Tell me about justice. Whatever it is, it's like, you know, somebody wants something to improve here. Look, ooh. <sighs> the higher fan reverse. You could be dealing with a Taurus. Ugh, Lord. For some of y'all, some of you guys could have found out that somebody was married. Somebody was like in a legal binding commitment. That's why I said marriage. Or maybe you just found out that this person was in a commitment and things are going to improve because of this. Maybe this person's going to get out of one. It's, y'all, yeah, I'm getting a couple of different storylines. Yeah, you guys are definitely going to have to leave some comments and let me know what's going on. Yeah, because somebody is carrying a burden here. Somebody is worried because they're not going to get a new opportunity. Or maybe you're feeling like you're not going to get a new opportunity with this person that you really want to be with. Yeah, and it's, you know, it frustrated you. Um, but I see you coming out of being frustrated. Some of you guys could have been dealing with a Capricorn here. Tell me about the devil. See. Tell me about the devil, please. Yeah, some of you guys are isolating yourself from a Capricorn here. Or if they're not a Capricorn, you're isolating yourself from this person who, you know, could have been just, you know, bring you through drama. Like they, you know, had some toxic behaviors and you're distancing yourself from it. But they're saying that you definitely need to make a decision about something here. Yeah, it looks like there was a breakup. But you're going to be coming out of being frustrated about it. You're no longer staying up worrying about it. But you're not moving forward with this person. What's going on? Yeah, you're stuck at a crossroads right now. Needing to make a decision. Nine of Wands here. You're undecided. You guys got to make a decision. Because this person right now is very immature. Behaving like a child, you know. And it's like, you know, you're stuck in this mental conflict here. You're feeling like something's been lost. But, you know, it's like, I don't want to start over with this person. I don't want to build anything. You're not being positive about the situation with the magician in reverse. With the six of wands in reverse, it's like, you know, you don't see a victory with this person. Knight of wands in reverse. It's like, and you're keeping quiet about it. Maybe, you know, you're just not talking to this person. Or if you are still talking to this person, you're keeping things very minimal, you know. Love is coming in slow. It's like communication is coming in very slow. Yeah, due to, you know, secrets. And it caused you not to have a happy home with this person, you know. You cut it off. King of Swords. Some of you guys could be dealing with an air sign. Um, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. Here is an Aquarius here. But it's like you don't have hope in the situation. You're tired of getting stabbed in the back, but you are coming out of feeling that way. Yeah, look at that. You're you want to come out of conflict. You're like, I'm tired. I'm not doing this drama anymore. 
you made a decision. Leo, that's you. You have strength now. It's like you're overcoming this. Though you're planting new seeds or the seeds that you're planting, you know, they can ready to go grow. Excuse me. Because it looks like with the chariot, you're moving on. I see you moving forward. Some of you got to be dealing with a cancer, but guess what, Leo? I feel like the, you're embodying the queen of pentacles in reverse. You're no longer putting your time, effort, or energy into the situation. And you're focusing on yourself. You're focusing on your finances because you're realizing there's not going to be a new beginning. But I feel like some of you guys are still watching this person. Somebody's spying. If it's not you spying on them, they're, they're watching and spying you on you through social media, you know. Or, you know, if you guys aren't friends on social media, they could just be asking people about you, just trying to keep tabs on you or vice versa. You know, and it's like you don't have a peace of mind. Or maybe they don't have a peace of mind about the situation. I see somebody wants to put in the work. Yeah, look at that. <sighs> okay, so it's like you're coming out of worrying about it, but at the end of the day, you're not putting in the work towards the situation because the truth came out about love or whatever. But the truth came out, could have been dealing with a Gemini here, but it's like somebody wants love. You know, there's love is here, but now it's like you're using your intuition and you're realizing that, you know, this situation is not going to improve. But there's an offer coming in for you, but I, this offer is like, mm, I think you're contemplating if you're going to take it or not because this person doesn't make you happy. There's no balance with this person at all. You don't know what their motives are because they keep playing you. There's too many people. Yeah, look, you're frustrated. But it looks like, um, you know, you're talking to family and friends trying to figure out what to do, but you might take a leap with this person. Or you might not for some of you. <laughs> Because with the Ace of Wands in reverse, it talks about, you know, you realizing or you feeling like there's not going to be a new beginning due to that three-party situation here. You know, but, oh, okay. Well, it looks like you're coming out of feel, feeling like you were left out in the cold. But with the Ace of Swords in reverse, you know, you're keeping things to yourself, Leo. You're not opening up to this person. You could have blocked communication. It's like you're tired of playing this little game. You know, so please leave me some comments, Leo. You know, let me know what's going on. Let me know if this resonates you know, for you guys or with you guys in the situation. I would love to get some feedback. All right, well, I hope you guys enjoyed your reading. Talk to you soon.